Hello everyone. So today I'm going to be doing a video on the uh, scrubbed cadet, or cup cadet, whatever you want to call it. Um, the exhaust fell off, so let's fix it. Um, these are the parts laid out on my awesome workbench uh, at Kenmore. You can get yours online for about $500. It is a very solid workbench. You can't put much on it, but it works. Anyway, um, so we've got... I don't know how exactly this failed. Um, we have very rough property, so I don't know if the bolts wiggled out. I don't know. This is not making sense to me, but it is what it is. got to fix it. Um, so you're going to need two of these screws. These are hex screws. These are all coiler. Okay, back to the video. So you'll need two of these screws. You'll need one of these gaskets because everything came off. I don't know what happened. Everything came off. And you'll need one of the... Oh, okay. And the gaskets are that. And then you'll need one of these uh, lock washers. Um, you'll need two of them. Um, just make sure you get two of each because there's four holes. Um, so you need like two screws, four screws, four lock washers, and two gaskets. Um, I didn't do that. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. I just misordered the parts. Um, now, for some reason, these little things are like needle in a haystack to find. Um, I got these really cheap at first, then they went to $15 a screw or a block washer. So my solution to that was getting a kit off of Amazon that has tons of lock washers. And how much you need lock washers around here, I figured a kit would be very useful. Uh, you also need a one quarter Allen, Allen wrench to get underneath there. This is not going to be a fun job. So, um, I'm going to take some of the parts out there and we'll do this uh, one side at a time. Um, this is not going to be fun because it's sitting outside and it's right now straight pipe. I really don't want to run it the way it is. So, okay, let's get this done. As you can see, I got my nice pop up tap. 10, I'm in the shade. Uh, let's get to working. Okay, so first step is get on the ground and assess the situation. And let's see if I can put you guys in a decent spot. I guess you guys can see it. Okay. So, the point of attack here is... Get one side lined up, and I should be able to just put the other side on, but this is a Cub Cadet. They don't design shit like John Deere to work on, that's for freaking sure. I don't know, not just, I don't know if I'm too very impressed with Cub Cadet. I'm just, just not. So, that bolt there. And then I need the other. Screw. Whoops. Screw. I should be able to do one side at a time. Now keep in mind, guys, this engine was rebuilt. Um, I know I didn't document it. But it was rebuilt. Um, had gaskets. I shouldn't say rebuilt. Um, we did a head gasket job on it and pretty much did a valve timing job on it then. And, you know, I brought it to the repair shop to see how much it was going to cost. And they're like, Do you do realize this is a box store mower, right? And I'm like, No. I mean, I know what a box store mower is, it's not the most greatest piece of equipment on the earth. But. Bigger and better things are about to happen on the Tractor Guy channel, so it's, I'm just going to leave it at that. Um, if you guys can guess what's coming, then, well, put it in the comments and we'll see who gets it right. So, now let's see if I screwed up this. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, let's guess which way this is supposed to go. I guess it doesn't freaking matter. Unless the camera goes in. Okay, so then... Then, I have to... I'm going to make sure I don't have anything sharp objects on me because i got to get down and dirty with the Cub Cadet. Take my keys off. Okay. Oh, thank God I'm not working in the sun. All right. So, this is going to suck. I remember doing this before. Uh, where my screws go? So, you guys are in a shot. Yeah, you guys can see me. Now, I don't know. 
It does not say to put any thread locker or anything on that. So for all you I do have to push it. I hate this. This is not gonna be a fun job. I might just scrap this entire motor. Just because this one issue. Find the hole! see a freaking thing. No, I can't get it. I can't get it. Ugh. And I remember doing this to get this muffler off. That was also not a fun job because you gotta get this thing started. screw but god damn just like that I think I got it yep I definitely got it okay yeah it's just a matter of um, hand coordination to get underneath there it's just not fun Oh, yeah, I'm definitely not a fan of Cup Cadet. I'll say that right now. Not a fan at all. It's just, I don't know, maybe this is putting my bad taste in my mouth because it's a box store mower. I don't know. Actually, so now what I have to do is, now that I got this side on, before I even tighten this damn thing, I've got to get my kit prepared for the other side. So, I'm going to turn you over here. Let's see what we got here. Need another screw. I know that much. I might have a screw loose or two in my head, but I definitely know we need a screw. Uh, let's see. So, I guess I'll go back to my spoiler that I said that big things were coming to this channel. Um, after this has been down, uh, the tiller's on the John Deere, so, and of course that's where you may be asking too, is where's the X585? We still have it. Um, it's not met its fate yet, but um, we've got a front axle seal leak on that, and um, I don't know if we are going to fix it I mean it's the weirdest thing ever it's wet but it's not actively leaking like I put fuel in it and then it stopped or not fuel I put grease for the gear lube um, in it and it seemed to have cured it um, but besides the point it the tillers on it and uh, this used to be my girlfriend's parents mower um, still is their mower um, I ended up kind of reviving it from the dead. Oh, that was a whole summer project last year. So, 
need that too. Um, when I revived it, you know, I was like, you know what? I can use it because their person that they had doing their job on the, for their lawn was not the greatest. Um, they were a lawn care company, and I was calling them half-ass lawn care. And I was being pretty serious. Oh, shit. I definitely did not want to do that. Oh, that's going to suck now. Because that's going to be water in it. But uh, we'll figure it out. Uh-oh, you guys are not in the shot. Let me make see that one. Now. Yeah, you guys are sort of in the shot. It's kind of hard to do this with a camera. Um, let's see, we got a... That's a gas leak, or is that that's some sort of leak? And don't mind my dog in the background. He's... He gets love, but... Okay. we go find a tarp or something quickly, because i got to lie down. I'm back with a towel. Alright, yeah, so this is not the most funnest jobs to do. Um, just isn't. Okay. So the gasket's got to slide. And of course I did this. Yes. Uh, one of the things that went lying on us. What's that? Oh! Oh, shit. <coughs> oh. Eat a bug? Yep. Yeah. Nom nom. Protein. All right, what were you saying about the things went flying? Yeah, that's like the tent that went flying on us. Well, you know, if you do it right and, um, you know, if you can set one of these tents up right. I can't get my hand on that again. Um, if you set it up right, it won't go flying. All right, so he's a crybaby and he's fine out there. When I went to go get him, Oh, well, yeah, then he definitely can stay out there. Okay, I'm okay with that. I figured there was something going on. And Hey, do you see my work environment, how I have to work? Is that through the head? Look at this. Uh oh, old pond high. Oh, I'm like, oh god, not another highway garage. I am in quarantine, so I cannot go play. That is not fair. Not fair. Every time I'm in quarantine. No, no, no. The whole freaking county goes to hell in a handbasket. Well, didn't they didn't hit Dickinson at the start? Well, it must be going, because that's Deputy Coordinator Tones. Oh, crap, my stick. Ooh. That sucks. Ooh! That ain't good. What's also not good is I can't get my fingers around this last bolt. Yeah, oh, that sucks. I hope they didn't come to work in that freaking app, and I hope that freaking sucks. Uh, let's see here. I'm gonna do some cursing here in the next five seconds. Because I cannot get a good position to sit my ass down and get that bolt in there. I can't even get my finger on it to turn. <sighs> oh, this is going to suck. Got it started. Let's find out. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Like, 
like seriously like if this if this thing's gonna keep breaking like this like I am just seriously gonna scrap this like I don't even know what the hell you would want So what I'm doing, guys, is I'm just now reaching up in here. I probably could get... I don't really have a socket set that's... really designed to do this very well. As you can see, I'm really struggling with this thing. I guess I don't even have to hold the fuck the exhaust. Let's see if I can just turn it. I'll just do it. Come on. Uh oh, there we go. <sighs> 